morning, it is Saturday today, and we are going on a very long drive. I need to do my suitcase up. Um, I've got about two minutes until we need to be at the van, so let's get cracking. Well, this suitcase is definitely feeling more full than it used to. So today is our second longest travel day of the trip, so not exactly thrilled about that but it will be fine. Um, I think we're stopping off at Mount Robson, which is the tallest mountain in the Canadian Rockies, and somewhere else. I do not know. But first we're having breakfast in Jasper. I've got my new Jasper t-shirt on, which I quite like. Oh. <laughs> there he is. Oh, no. oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. That was oh, that looks like so the looks like he's making a noise. That would be a caribou, not an elk. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's oh, a caribou. Oh, oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Oh, wow. 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 Oh, wow
So it is a few hours later. We have been chilling in the hot tub, which was really fun. Um, after fishing out some flies and figuring out how to work it all. It's like an outdoor hot tub pool area, which is quite nice. And we were the only ones there, which was really nice. And now we are off to dinner. But sadly my camera, the lens thing that comes down has um, not like closing. So I feel like the life of this camera is coming to an end and that makes me very sad. We've been through a lot together, me and this camera. <sighs> so sad. I hope I hope you fix yourself, camera. Please. Thank you. Right, we better go. We've gone from um, ow, chilling in the hot tub in the sunshine to running away from a desert storm. There's like sand roll like coming down the street and hitting us in the legs, and it's about to absolutely chuck it down. And my dress keeps going up. <laughs> all happening. Deny standard hasn't exactly been the most thrilling day today. We are, oh, can you see that the camera is a bit broken? Look, it's not, um, these bits aren't going up properly. Sad times. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much been a driving day, and sadly, we have another driving day tomorrow, so can't wait for that. Um, it's just been a lot more driving than anticipated and there's been some more Trek America related drama that's kicked off as well. But the good thing is we had a really nice dinner at a really authentic Mexican restaurant and the family who obviously owned the place were all there and it was so lovely, like proper family run business. We even had like the little girl giving out our menus and stuff. It was so nice. Then tomorrow we're off to Whistler. So it's another long travel day tomorrow, but Hopefully we'll get there. But in the meantime, I've got a lovely sleep in a nice double tree bed, which I'm very excited for. So I'll see you tomorrow. Night, night. Hello, we are in Kamloops. It is a Sunday. It is 6.59 a.m. And I have to be out of this room at seven. So we're rushing as usual. I got my bounce jumper on today, which I very much like. But that also does mean that the weather is pretty rubbish outside. We had that crazy storm last night. Um, so thankfully it's not like that this morning, but it still looks pretty gray and damp. So we've got another long travel day today, which I didn't really think was coming, but there you go. Um, I think we've got like a seven hour trip in the van, but that includes all the stops and stuff. And then we're getting to Whistler this evening. We only have like two days left, or two nights left on the whole tour now. We just had a rare breakfast in the hotel at the buffet that they've got here, which was all right. It was nice to have an actual buffet breakfast, which I was kind of expecting every day, but it hasn't worked out as planned. I think this is basically because a few people had complained about the quality of the breakfast. If you didn't watch that video, we were given a $25 gift card to Tim Hortons and 25 for Starbucks at the start of the trip um, when it said that breakfast was included every day. So, yeah, not the best. Is that because my lens is, is broken on this camera? But yeah, I think we're getting in the truck soon. I can't see it at the minute. And it's raining. Huh? But at least I have a very full towel. these people taking pics of the lake. So down, it's the other side of that bridge just there. Oh, Rachel saw, was it in the water? I 
was literally snoozing and I woke up so fast <laughs> to try and see the bear. Where are you, Mr. Bear? First Nations people, so we're gonna have a look around, Let's maybe stop at a cafe, get some snacks, lunch. Yeah! It's a generous hunk of jade. Hopefully, nothing is open because it is a Sunday, everything is closed except for the bakery. Yay! The abundance of people. A bakery. <laughs> my favourite kind of chocolate. Oh, look and have, here we go, a candid of Oh Look Me exploring oh, my look. next trip. Look, Get everyone I'm so travelly. I'm so travelly. <laughs> you were actually so nice travelling, you were the same. Look at this little purple house, and they even have a purple car. I love it. One day I will go on you train. So there it is. That's why it's a one day. <laughs> so, so you can see like yeah, we're on those in Switzerland. Very cool, but if it's a hot day, you get like sunburned. <laughs> Like We're being naughty. Drunk yeah. <laughs> Just in that little area there. Oh, it's baby poutine. Oh. These clouds everywhere. God, that one's literally just there. Wow. Probably shouldn't uh, vlog and try to cross the road at the same time. Just had uh, poutine. I just had poutine from McDonald's. Who even knew that was? a thing that you can get and it was actually pretty decent it was better than standard mcdonald's fries and i've got a um diet coke which is probably a bad idea because caffeine but to be honest i have been falling asleep all day in the van oh, i'm just getting so bored being in the van it's endless um but i'm just heading back now i think we've only got 45 minutes till whistler now Ooh. so at least we'll get there at a normal time which would be nice we stop in lillooet for our morning break. Now we're in Pemberton and we're nearly at Whistler. Ooh. But a little bit has the Fraser River, which is when we um were what's the word white water rafting on, and it goes all the way down out to Vancouver. So this is the Yellow Brick Road right here on your right. We're coming into the village right now. We've just got to our little Whistler Lodge. Look at how many chairs we have. Oh, should we make a little fire? Please use fire logs only. Oh, that's a big step. Oh, well there you go. see the driving range and the pool, the baby pool and tennis court and what looks like, like a bear. Bear? Are you a bear? 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 Oh, we've just got to Whistler where we have our lodge in Whistler. <laughs> 
and I've already fallen over. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening to me. I didn't used to fall over and now I fall off bikes <laughs> and fall up steps. I'm it's all the luxury of Whistler. It's just I'm just so overwhelmed by Whistler <laughs> that I just <laughs> I just fall, you know. <laughs> it's all going on going for dinner today already has foam cannons going and I don't know if we're really we're really that type of group Officially closed down spaghetti house. Tarantula Lodge. Tarantula. Home sweet home. It's actually not as cold as I thought. Yay. Which is the end of our last long travel day of the tour. Yay. Which also does mean that it's nearly the end of the tour. We've got two days left, two nights left, including tonight. Crazy. Um, so yes, we had a nice dinner at the pasta place. I got a takeaway box as well. So cheap as well. I think my dinner was like $15, which was for a soup, a pasta, an ice cream and a tea. Crazy. So good. So at least I've saved some money there. Um, I'm going to have sleep in this little single bed. Oh well. Tomorrow we're going zip lining and exploring Whistler some more. So that will be very exciting. I can't wait to take the GoPro zip lining because that was the whole reason I brought it on this trip. So that'll be fun. And yes, thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.